live from our studios in Toronto, Canada. This is 100 Huntley Street. We invite you to join us for the next 60 minutes. Our co-host this week is the former academic dean of a Bible college, Dr. Charles Rotz. Our guest today is Dr. Clark Pinnock, professor of theology at McMaster University. Musically, it's Canada's balladeer, Wiz Bryant, and Norma Jean Maines. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your host, David Maines. it is hello Gor <laughs> my microphone wasn't on now you see I sat under a professor of theology not under a professor of television communications that's why I'd make a mistake like that Gordon but you and I are learning your producer a producer now as well aren't you yes David with nightlight and uh, we're seeing uh, every well m Monday through Friday which is actually Tuesday morning to Saturday morning from 3 30 to 5 30 live uh, talk show where people call in and we minister and talk to them, pray with them on the phones. And of course, uh, talking about uh, professors of theology, I've been kidding you a little yeah. bit about getting your professor yeah. here from Princeton University, where, where you're a graduate in theology as well. And we appreciate you doing the checkup today. You've got lots of books here to help you in your checkup. Now, I've got some helpful books here today as well. Dr. Rotz, who was my teacher, uh, this is one of his books. It's a commentary on the book of Romans, which is available at least across Canada in the Bible bookstores. And uh, then we have a gentleman here today who's professor of theology at McMaster University. This is a special week. Uh, you and I are having a refresher course this week with all these professors here. But uh, this is one of his books called Reason Enough, which is distributed by InterVarsity uh, Press. And uh, this is a mighty book of... Uh, well, giving a reason for faith in God, reasons. And uh, I'm looking forward to talking with Dr. Pinnock today. And, of course, i got another book here, which I hope you have. This is my notebook. I'm taking notes of Dr. Rotz's teaching and other things that happen, Gordon's summary that he does each day of what he believes God is saying to him. So you, you should have a notebook as well. And, of course, the book. <laughs> All right, here's the book. And by the way, this is the New King James Version. We have a professor from Wycliffe College, which is an Anglican college here in Toronto, coming up, I think, two days from now. He'll be on. And he was one of the major translators for the New King James Version, a, the latest revision of the King James Bible. So lots of great and special things coming up this week. Gordon, I've been excited about this week. How have you felt? I feel great, David, because there's been a put-down of the... Well, I call it the intellectual side of the gospel. And I think we need to have men who are teaching it, who put it together properly, so that, that well, that men can be prepared to preach the gospel and share it. Uh, I know I get phone calls, like yesterday morning I got a... Uh,